What's happening? What up, what up, baby? You know what it is. You better listen. This ain't nothing but some boss talk. A hundred thousand on my wrist. Fuck around, spend up a thousand on your bitch. She get nasty. Shout out that boy PGL. Shout out, man. Man. It's going down. Hold up. Know that I ain't shit. Oh yeah, there's some real ones. There's some real ones out there, baby. Hey man, check it, man. Check it, man. It's your boy ECO, and this another great segment. Hey, Boss Talk 101 in the building, man. I got my boy Spook in the building, and I got my boy Watts in the in the in the house, man. What's going on, man, Mister Hundred Thousand? Man, you know what what's going on, man? <laughs> Say, <laughs> man, shoot, man. I just, hey, I pulled up on the block today. Really, just, hey, man. You know, I just sometimes want to sit back here, man. You know, last night, man, I was sitting back watching that versus, man. My, you know, I'm a UGK. <laughs> You know, look, man. I don't play by UGK, man. Oh, so man. really, before it even th before it even started, I already had made my decision. I ain't gonna lie to y'all, man. Hold on. You I already had made my decision. It started. I already made my decision. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, but man. at the end of the day, I love MJG and A Ball. Yeah, right. So right, you know, right. I, I already, you know. I really like the way that uh, you know, just the whole you know, when when the rumble in the jungle or the two titans meet up. Yeah. You know, that's my thing, man. And 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 you get to see, okay, man, this legacy, this history that goes down, man, you know, it tripped me out because I've watched a lot of verses. But man, you know, when I look at the way this thing happened so fast, mm. it mm -hmm. messed me up because I ain't used to seeing, you know, uh something that just pop off like that and then, you know, I'm like, damn, man, where they having it at? Before it could get started, yeah. before the information could get out there, it already had happened. Yeah. yeah. It was like, when did you where hear did about this it? come from? Like, I thought it was going to be like this weekend or something. I started hearing about it this week, you know? And then I'm like, uh, well. My wife turned on the phone and she's like, where this at? And I was like, huh? <laughs> so you, did, you didn't even hear about it from nobody. You just happened to be flipping through the switches and through the internet, bam. Man, well, I heard it from you that it was going to happen. I did tell you because I know? tell everybody, yeah. man, like, it's going down. Yeah, I didn't hear about it but two days before it happened. And it's just like, yeah. you know. Did you hear about I'm it? Like, yeah, like a week ago. A week ago? Yeah. A week? Well, not even a week. Not even a week. You couldn't hear You must not be psyched. I, I said about like three week, days. Though. I think uh -huh. Bud, I like Bud announced week. it on his on his uh, Instagram. Okay. And then they linked in. I guess because it was in Atlanta, they didn't. They didn't really. I mean, Texas. Yeah. I mean, I ain't. I, I I really ain't heard from nobody. You know, being that we in Texas and UGK sure. is definitely a Texas. Yeah, Texas I was like, where you would have hype at? That's what I'm saying. You yeah. know, but it's a lot of time. Like I said, it's a lot of time, bro. And I don't, I don't want to feel, be salty, but uh -huh. it seemed like a lot of time they don't really, you know, I don't know, man. The platform been here. We done did almost a thousand episodes. We show so much love to all the different down south. Yeah. Uh, 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 the, the patriarchs. I mean, I done had any, anybody from, hey, man, you can look at anybody that's been doing this and doing it for a while. ESG, uh, all these boys, man, uh, uh, Carl Crawford, mm -hmm. uh, uh, Lil Runny, uh, yeah. uh, Half Pint, you know, uh, trying to go down, Gator Man, you know, he, uh, uh, anybody that I could think of in the South trying to get these people uh, uh, something, giving out awards, doing everything I could, and I want to be an outlet where I can tell the people what's going on, man, but a lot of times, and we've been in this store, we've been doing business for 15 years here at this sport, black-owned business, guys. <laughs> Y'all been coming here, so you know already I've been here, but then it's like, when you're trying to help a community or help a, a culturistic people, yeah. it's like you almost, I mean, being a brother is already a strike against you and being independent. Because right. for some reason, we have this thing where we don't even, we self-inflict each other with issues where it don't have to be. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, I still show love. I'm like God. <laughs> yeah, when you when you don't even love me, I still love you. And you go, you hear what forgive, I just said? Huh? I'm like God, I forgive you. If yeah. you put me on the cross and you already and you nailing me, I'm mm -hmm. still gonna say forgive them for they know not what they do. Uh -huh. Cause that's how much I love my people, man. Yeah. So yeah. I don't I don't know if I ever stop loving them, even though they don't give me that love back a lot right. of time. But right. at the end of the day, it's all love regardless. Yeah, you know it's what I'm all saying? Love regardless. So so at the end of the day, I said that to say. 
they could come in, they could call, they could do some things to reach out to these platforms and let people know, hey, yeah. this here is going on. Let's make an announcement. I don't care if it's two days before. You know right. niggas that what know. What Pac say, niggas. do your thing, boy. I ain't mad at you. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it, for yeah, you. yeah, yeah. It's, it's, yeah. A lot of, it's a lot of time. We could do things a lot better and put the word out there and get it to our people, man. Right, um, right. Because uh, I think a lot of people missed out that would have viewed it. But if they would have viewed it, you know, I talked to a couple of people that really was like, man, it was, you know, it wasn't all that. But I can't do that because... I got so much love for the South, man, that I ain't for to even play that game. But hold on. I feel like it could have been better. What do you mean? <laughs> well, I like, when you introduce UGK coming out, you know, holographic or two, uh, uh, Pimp C. He not her. You know what I'm saying? Something that uh, make everybody go, ah! It, it was like an introduction that was like, okay, you know. All right, the trillers. What what you Bumby. think? What, what you, all right. What you think, Spoo? It was just like all right. That, that would have been dope. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah. It's Pimp. Yeah, that would have been. Yeah. It Pimp been was dope. the lit one. So you got to bring some action into it. Yeah. Bum B sit back, he chill, he him. We know Bun. He gonna be him. Yeah, but he still did his thing. Yeah, you know, he time, did his man. thing. He represented the pimp yeah. the way he should. He had the pimp C shirt on the inside. Right. And so I, just that just that that statement alone showed love and then I the daughter came up at the end. I didn't see the sons and uh -huh. the, the one son. I know one of them home or whatever, but at the end of the day, you know, I just the energy it was dope to to, to hear all those old songs. I got to get that up. You know what I yeah. mean? I love the MJG, man, when that nigga started. That nigga did just, you don't make me. <laughs> that nigga still got it, man. MJG still got it, man. Maybe Ball, they feel I think, sad because Pimp Ball, wasn't there. I think that's what made you them know, I think they held back a little bit. It was kind of a damn you know, they moment. Back, they, yeah. I think it, people still miss and long for Pimp, man, because it's an emptiness right there when you look at that whole legacy that them boys brought, man. Yeah. It's an emptiness right there yeah. when Pimp ain't around, man. It was that yeah. energy. Man, his you know? songs were playing like that too. Like it's it's hard to even mm -hmm. go say anything after you hear Pimp say, right. so, "Hey, man, it was like I was supposed to hear oh, Bon B and smoke some." You yeah, know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, Maybe but, it was the crowd, man. Whoa, what oh, you mean by the that? Crowd. Maybe it was the crowd, man. Yeah. I seen oh. a, I seen a few people yeah, turning yeah, up. They, they they really wasn't into me like that. They won, you know. They won spitting the bars. They they not doing the lyrics, man. They, they had to try to wake but you him know, up. But you know, would have came out there like Gucci. He would have. Well, uh, Bun tried, Bun tried but to. Bun tried to. Bun tried to. Bun tried to. Gave him a competition. On. It's a versus. Yeah. You supposed to give a competition. Let us see what you got. Tell them that, uh, man. You know we man, was running I stuff. Know. We decide, man. And you know, on, I man. love ATL. My, my, so, my brother-in-law live down there. I'm always down there. Uh-huh. But... Some in me keep saying, man, why didn't do it do it in Texas where, you know, the energy is here. We love right. Do you know how hard we go for, for Memphis? Now man? that's a good question. Do you know how hard we go for Suave House actually go back. Suave House and, and MJG and A Ball Neil was in Houston when they first started they run. Mm. Now that's, that's huge. That's true. Now why didn't they do it in Houston? That's, true. that's the big question. I don't know. Did they? Well, did they do? Uh, uh, what did they do? Jada Kiss in them at? Um, Cameron, Jada Kiss. In New York. You show? Uh, I don't know. What? Was it in New, New York? York? Look it up. Was it in New York? Uh, I know it's Trina said it was in her city. Trina did you know? hers in her city too. You know, so. in Miami. So yeah, let's let's look that up. You know, I, I'm I ain't trying. think about that earlier. What? I ain't think about that earlier. I don't know, man. Like I said, man, you got to realize. I thought it was more convenient for them to be in, be in Atlanta, though. Why you, you know, say that? Uh. Most of those uh, artists, they from Atlanta. I mean, they stay in Atlanta. Who, MJG and A-Ball? I don't know where they stay. They probably got a house, <laughs> probably got a house in Atlanta, too. They got nothing in Houston or Dallas? I mean, out of, you know. What's wrong with that? Right. Dallas got the affordable homes, nigga. <laughs> yeah, I don't know about now. I knew about three years ago. Yeah, we were going <laughs> nah, man. I, I actually, like I said, I, I know that 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 one right there was one that that we can't go back and change what happened. Right. So, do you feel like Spook that it it was on the level that you wanted to see it? Be real. I mean, we on Boss Talk One One. What a bosses talk. What a bosses talk. That I would. Do you feel like it was on the level that it needed to be on or? 
Do you feel like it, it, the energy was there? Or, uh, I mean, the songs was uh, they kept, they turned them on. They were hyped to me. I mean, mm-hmm. it, was like, it was okay to me. Uh, I heard I, I heard my uh, soundtrack. <laughs> that's what I used to. That's what I was. That's what I used to listen to. You know, that's my soundtrack. That's my CD. That was Which my one? CD. Both of them mixed together. In the black that, that was in your car, <laughs> right? Hey, and a little for, for the uh, Black Central. You hear me? Spook yeah. said that was his. That was his mixtape right there. Oh, that was my mixtape. <laughs> when them niggas bumping came out, hey, bump, bumping both of them boys. You know, I ain't gonna lie. When they when, when they be like, lay it down, lay it down. You hold yeah. lay it down. That crowd was supposed to be into that though. That crowd, that crowd was supposed to help them though. That crowd was supposed to help them. Yeah, they wasn't that crowd singing. Was to help them. Why do you think that was? Man, I don't know, man. It got to be because it was, wasn't they, they city because it says here that the locks and dips set was in Madison Square Garden. Right. Right. So, Where I was at? You know, and them boys were cutting up up there. And another Ooh, thing, Bun home, them, hey, when Bun them did the rodeo the other week, they talk about, I talked to Lil Kiki when I interviewed him. Yeah. Man. When Lil Kiki came out there, nigga, I felt something. I ain't going to lie to you, nigga. That yeah. nigga brought that energy even down there in Atlanta. Them niggas had to look, man. That nigga not yeah. nobody to play with, bro. Yeah, I'm serious. I'm telling you now. Yeah. That nigga, they're bad. He, he dog. gonna stand. He on gonna. Go, he not coming to, to play with y'all. To to the the day woo, that don't I'm do that, not. boy. Hold uh, on, uh, 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 don't get so, me started. Say, but hey, but I'm telling you, man, the energy would have been different. Yeah. What you think? If they did in Memphis. Man, I think they could have did it in Memphis and it would have been turned up. Like, like, if they did that in Houston or Memphis, what do you think? Yeah, Memphis would have been a fool. We saw the game. We saw the game. (laughs) They could have brought it to the Warriors game. We saw saw the Warriors game, man. You know. So why do you think it? Because Atlanta got so many different celebrities, bro. Yeah. They, you gotta, Mm -hmm. man. Listen. Yeah. Bro, they got their mindset already. It's a lot of different celebrities. Different yeah. artists, you got Future down there. Yeah. You got you got Ti down you put there. Future and you little baby got Jeezy down there. You, you got little like, baby, what? nigga. You put little baby and uh, uh, give me yeah, and Future. Yeah. Do you know what happened in that land? It's gonna be turned. Yeah. You gonna have to have a metal you can do you can do the baby. <laughs> you can do the baby and little baby, and yeah. that whole will erupt in that land. Oh man, yeah, and they right there, close to each other. They should have did that thing over here, man. You know, that's a long right drive though, you know, from Texas. You know, we had a big debate about that earlier. Hold on, I'm finna call. I, let, me, let me see, man. I got to uh, get a big debate about that. Let me about see. That, let me you see. Know. <laughs> you know what? Yeah, um, that, yeah, I ain't think about that. You know. Man. Now, you, what you, what you, what you think? The crowd was dead. <laughs> <laughs> the crowd was dead, bro. I think I seen two dudes it just, it wasn't, it wasn't, it wasn't they was just swaying you know, side man. to side. Like, right. I'm yeah, like, okay, to, you know. Yeah, man. Man, that crowd was, it, it was, it wasn't just, we had, they put the, they put the camera on one girl down there though. Mm. And she was going in, but it yeah. should have been a whole thing. The way, the way them niggas legacy is. Yeah, that's big. Bruh, eight ball. That's what I'm saying. That nigga, that nigga, bro, when that nigga be rapping, man, that nigga, man, God, eight ball. What was the promotion outlet? I'm trying to figure out. Like, I don't really remember Why seeing didn't it? it pop up on my Instagram when I. Turned it on like everything else, so they did, you know, they did, you know, oh, they did it the last minute. Oh, yeah, yeah. they did it the last minute, yeah, man. man, man. I, I, nah, I, I, I don't feel like there was nothing that should have been last minute about it, you know, because. What would man. you have done if you was if you was doing it? I told you I would have put that holographic of Pimp C saying smoke something and came out. Hey, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, same, it would have been same, lit. Same. You got to get the crowd up. They know it's all about crowd what participation. What you said was really going down in the south. You know, huh? You know what I'm saying? Bomb B could have came through there and made it a mm-hmm. little more lava. It seemed like he was still in like, man, pimp dead, man, type it, it, of mode. It, well, you heard, bro. Like I said, you know, I, I'll be real with you, man. Like like um, Bobo, when he came on here mm-hmm. and uh, we sat and talked, um, man, that's not a and – I, and I keep telling not only him, even when I talk to Steve, them dope dudes, man, 
man, that was a big loss for everybody, for He's a Leo, for mm. 17, for all them boys, man. Yeah. People, they, I think they underestimate the, the, the weight of that loss. And then when you think about the legacy that Pimp C and UGK and Bun B and them had in the Bun and Mama West, man, that was a yeah. big loss to lose them people like that, bro. Yeah. I think they underestimate how heavy a, a loss that was in trying to come back off of it and not being real with it, man, because it takes some – Therapy, it takes a lot yeah. of stuff to get that thing get to get everything back going, man. Uh, I think, man, from what Bobo yeah. said before he came on my show, he hadn't been on no show, period. Mm. Mm. He hadn't, he, he didn't, he was just did too depressed, he didn't want to deal with it. So, it probably sent a lot of people into a state of depression and they probably didn't get the mental help that they probably needed, and it's probably still hurting them to this day, exactly. That's mm -hmm. what I think. That's you know. that's the way I feel about it, to be quite honest with you. Yeah. Um, I just feel like it's so, it's it's a it's a sad occasion, man. When when you look at um, the loss and and you see what happened, uh, like I said, to 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 the to all the lives that was uh, affected by yeah uh, him. You know, he was young, man. He was no old cat. This thing happened sudden too. Yeah, you know, there's there's times when you know I lost my granddaddy, and he was uh ninety something. Yeah, one of them. And I, I could kind of deal with that. I ain't gonna yeah. lie to you, but when you lose somebody that's thirty something, yeah, that's hard. And you didn't know they was gonna leave, right? And just came out, and just on got the out biggest of, I just, hype. just came out of prison and everything. That Man. was that. That was a big loss. And I keep, I keep telling everybody, you can't just get around that like they're trying to do it. But look, it's been it's been eleven years, man. It's been a long time too, though. Yeah. Yeah. So, what do y'all think? Yeah, you know, because people can criticize all day. What do you think that that what what do you think the next best verses will be? <laughs> oh man. Uh, <laughs> actually, we were listening to a Kendrick Lamar album, right? And on one of the songs, you know, he said, <laughs> "Him and this girl was going back and forth," and one of his things was more like. That's why y'all can't even feature on the song with each other. Like, cause he talking to a girl in a man's perspective and she talking to him in a woman's perspective. Yeah, yeah. That's Kendrick. Can you name a song where these girls have featured with each other on? Which girl? Like anybody, like a rapper, a R and B is. Can you name one? That who has featured on, on on featured on what? A girl has featured on another girl album. You know how little baby yeah. put future yeah. on it. You know the baby and yeah, little baby nigga got Brandon a song. Monica the did it. That's, the only <laughs> <laughs> That's what my wife said. <laughs> <laughs> the boy is my name. Yeah. Yeah. What's the one with the ladies' night? Oh man, yeah, man, yeah, yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah, no, man, yeah. You heard how long ago that nigga did that? Look, Kim did that, nigga. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Look, Kim did that latest night yeah, with the brat, see, nigga. Yeah, Stop loud. playing, ladies, ladies. Uh, 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 Cardi B and Megan just did okay. it, nigga. Yeah, yeah, yeah nigga. Yeah, yeah nigga. A lot of them. It's been yeah, they had a little, little, little yeah. bitty situation. Yeah. Some name, some more. It's not. <laughs> hey, what's, what's the one? Look if you buck. We over here thinking, huh? Look if you buck. That's a group, nigga. Yeah, that was yeah, a but group. They, still was, they was together. Yeah. You know. Man. It's, yeah, they be collabing. That's kind of hard. They collab a lot. We got some here in Dallas. That's kind of hard. That's a hard one. Collab. All I'm going to say is uh, Nikki and Cardi B was on one. And they tricked them into doing that. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah you're right. You're right. <laughs> they tricked them into doing that. Right. Oh, man. Yeah. They didn't really want to do that, bro. Like, they did it, but they like, bro, come on, man. You're right. You know? Uh, so, but It's hard. I'm, a, I'm. I said I was gonna let. I was gonna let Sko weigh in because Sko, Sko is a. Uh, he he a real. He'll stomp down. Uh, yeah. Now, uh, I want to ask the yeah. question: How he got his name? 
Who? Yo, hold on. Yo, Chris Co. Good, bro. Co. What's up, Chris Co? How you doing, man? Welcome <laughs> to Boss up? Talk 101. What a bosses talk. Hey, man, uh, I seen you last night when the verse was going on, nigga. You had a whole bunch of people that were rocking with that show, man. And there was a lot of opinions came through, but I just wanted to hear your opinion <laughs> of, of how you felt about the uh, verses and uh, just uh, what you think about it. Man, bro, it was dope, man. It was, it was a classic moment for the South. I like the whole South one. You know, yeah, we was in there. It was a party last night. You know what I mean? Go gang or no gang. You know how we do it over there. So it was going to be a party in there every night. We, we put the verses up. They pulled up. Memphis, Port Arthur, head to head. I went through the classic moment now. I am a Texas guy. I'm from Texas. <laughs> so, you know, I got to ride with Bun and Pimp. You know, rest in peace to Pimp C. So I got to run with Bun and Pimp. But, of course, it's a classic moment. MJ, MJG, A Ball, man. I've been one of my favorite groups of all time. But Space Age Pimpin' was my favorite song with a night. But like I say, I'm from Texas, man. But no, nah, it was dope, man. It was dope. You know what I mean? Man, I seen a lot of them. Some of those, some, I heard, I seen some of those uh, comments. Uh, some of them was good, some of them wasn't, though. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, far as, you know, I, I, I know I got a couple of cats in here. We've been going back and forth about why I didn't have them in Texas or why I didn't have them in Memphis and all kind of stuff. You know, we out here tripping. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know, but at the end of the day, we understand, too, that just for it to happen at all was a big, big yeah. thing. Yeah. You know? yeah. Put together quick, you know. It was, it was put together clean. quick. When did you yeah, hear about yeah, this, though? When did you hear about it? Uh, I heard about it what, about a couple about a week or two ago. I heard about it. Oh, you heard about it two right weeks ago? How, yeah, how I, you heard about it? Because I only heard about it like two weeks ago. Like well, like well, 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 I'm going to be, well, be honest with you. I'm going to be honest with you. I heard about it through the loop to my dog, Lil Flip. Yeah, I mean, I heard about it through Flip. He was telling me that uh, that he had chopped it up with Bun. And that Bun was telling me that, yeah, we're we, we going to put the verses together. We're going to actually do that. I heard so, about you know it. Yes, I actually, I actually, Flip had told me about it, you know what I mean, a couple, like, I once a couple weeks ago, they like, actually going to put it together, he was talking about the going down there and all that, so, yeah, I knew it was coming, I, you know, like, the, the Triple Six Mafia, uh, Bone, uh, you know, versus, I ran that too, so, on my channel, I like to just do stuff for hip-hop, I thought like those are classic moments, we gotta get them brothers, they flowers, um, I was a little upset, though, I feel like there's some moments in hip-hop that need to happen, I don't give a damn what nobody say they need to happen, and I feel like Jay Z should have came out when Big Pimpin dropped. You feel? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like hoes should have pulled up, man. Ooh. I feel like hoes should have pulled up, bro. I feel like it's moments in hip hop that we missed it. Like, nigga, we well, you, can't, you, can't, you, can't, you, nah, you can't, you can't just say that and then don't say Andre 3000 and they was in Atlanta. <laughs> Man. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three thousand to the You, you can't I say that. Ti, he was he definitely uh, 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 got a song called Front Back from UGK, yeah. <laughs> and, and yeah. Pimp C was missing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and he did it but when Pimp C was locked up. I think I know he did. Oh man! But you may say something. I feel like Big Pimpin is the biggest record we ever heard UGK on. Right. You know what I mean, it was that real breakout record. It was that. You know yeah. what I mean? That, man, that's what the I can't world say that, bro. Because yeah. when you look yeah, at nah, that, I feel that, like that's that's what that was the world. Jordan, no, the East the South, yes. You talking yes. joining everybody? Joining the East and the South. Because to me, that 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 Andre three thousand and uh, that that anthem, what they call it. Man, that's the one. Man, that's the, players, the biggest one to the me. Players, wow, because the last, because of the players, Oh yeah, I've been saying this. Hey, that's the one. But Big Pimpin is the one. Yeah, Big Pimpin. You know, Pimpin Big Pimpin was the one. one that really. Yeah, yeah, the boys crossed over with that. That's the one that made yeah. me say, "Hold up, this is in a back door with sipping on." I think they're trying to buy us, man. In a back door with sipping on some scissor, literally like months later. Like you know what I mean? Yeah. So yeah, yeah, that's, that's, that's what we really start seeing them boys. Even Pimp get locked up. I think months later. So yeah, like, yeah, yeah, man. yeah. What did you? Th what about yeah. you, Watson? You had a question for uh, Crisco. Crisco, how you get your name, man? You said about boss honest, talk, nigga. It was on boss talk, but go ahead, Chris. Go. Yeah, I, yeah, I yeah, 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 yeah. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, 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 bro. You know what I mean? Yeah, first name Chris, last name Sco. You know, nigga just always uh, called me Sco. You know what I mean? Uh, hey, 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 trust me. Hey, growing up, man, hey, I'm always trying to sell something. You're my nigga. I'm always trying to sell something. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. Yeah. Hey, I, I might know do that. if you got burned yeah, with some yeah, grease. Oh, uh, what? Oh, <laughs> what? Yeah, nah, 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 my, nah. My name is really Chris. You know what I mean? Uh, you know what I mean? It's last name Sco. You know what I mean? Yeah, you know what Chris Sco. We just put it together, man. Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Niggas call me Sco. Name Chris. Chris, my nigga, yeah. So you don't even know who you're talking to. Oh, this 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 that boy Brandon Watts, man. 
Watts. What's good, bro? What's good? What's good with it, man? Haven't seen you in a long time. You haven't called me up for a studio session, but I guess since I changed my number, that's what it is. <laughs> you did, man. Right. That nigga say since I changed my number. Yeah, nigga gonna be able to get in touch with you, nigga. You done changed your shit up. You know what I mean? But nah, it's, all, it's all good. We all out here still working. We all grinding. Nah, for real. We right. see you, man. Right. What, time you, what time you going on tonight? Uh, tonight I'm I'm debating. I might go on around ten. It's Fridays. So I go on late sometime. Uh, we go Friday, Saturday night. So if I I might go on. All I got, all I got to do is push that button. They gonna pull up. How did you come so, yeah, up man. with that, man? How did you? What made you just jump out? I know you did it after uh, Mo Three pass, but yep, but just yep. just what made you say? You know what? This is the way I'm gonna do it. Like cause you you like the like I say you you and me both talk a lot. So that that midnight that Harado feel like you out yeah. there. Yeah, yeah, you you know you, what, know, you go is. in, hey, bro. It's that late night, it's that Geraldo, it's that that uh, it's that uh, that David Letterman. You know what I mean? That, 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 <laughs> right. You know what I mean? I, I want to be that late night guy who come out, you know, with a show that everybody pull up and talk. You know, break yeah. news down what's going on. Like I said, we don't we don't break the news, we just break it down. So I don't create news. <laughs> I just talk about what's already going on. I ain't gonna create no shit to make that stuff. But I'm gonna talk about what's already going on in the news. I think I get people a platform to pull up. You know, you know, I'm talking about niggas who can't sleep at night. You know, the have not, the poor people, everybody. No matter what wave of life you're from, pull up to the show, man. Kick it with me. Light some of that good CBD up. You know what I mean? We call it the CBD on the show. We ain't gonna call it that. You know what I mean? Yeah. You light that good CBD up and pull up, man. Have a drink, whatever, man. Let's chop it up like grown folks. Let's really talk. I just want to get a platform where we can pull up and, you know, chop it up, bro. Right. Let yeah. me ask you a question, uh, and, and this is going back to the, uh, the, the verses, man. Uh, did you see that boy Tila in that hole last night, man? Yes, man. Hey, <laughs> legend, man. Hey, legend. Yeah, that boy had on a mean coat or something. Dude. Ooh, that boy had a mean coat. I think they did that in, in, in memory of him. Yeah. You know? and, yeah, and man. Yeah, man. Tila, my guy, though. Tila, my guy, man. You know what I mean? Tila, man. yeah, he one of them legends, bro, who needed flowers. You feel me? So that's why I like the verses because. You know, niggas like that wouldn't get their flowers. You know what I mean? Just like we've right. seen little yeah. to do the freestyle, you know, during the Triple Six Mafia bone mm -hmm. battle. You know, some cats that you bring them out to let niggas know, now they still around, man. I don't forget what they did for the game. Right, You feel right. me? So everybody not going to get to go and drink champs and shit like that. Yeah. You know what I mean? So, yeah, we got to find well, all different well, kind of well, ways to get the OGs they flowers. Well, let me just be honest with you. You, you can't get on drink champs. You might get on boss talk because we set up over man, here. Man, you can pull up right there, man. <laughs> hey, you stop you playing, right nigga. You know what I'm saying? I hate to, say, talk, I hate to do you like that. Yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, no, but hey, we need shows like boss talk. You're right, especially for the South. So yeah, we know how the game is, you know what I mean? It's a lot of niggas in the South that need some flowers. A lot of cats in the game, like you said, they come to Boss Talk. You giving out, with, you, you niggas giving out uh, jackets and niggas fuck flowers. Them niggas giving out outfits over there at Boss Talk. Man, we been kicking it, man. <laughs> niggas wearing getting plaques. Niggas, niggas, yeah, yeah, niggas, 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 niggas been giving niggas 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 roses, niggas niggas plaques, niggas jackets. jackets. Yeah. Come on, my yeah. nigga. And niggas is real that's quiet that's about that, though. Niggas is quiet about this Southern hospitality, though. They saw it last night. Huh? They showed it last night. What? During the verses. So what? Some Southern, Southern hospitality. What did you see? Did uh, I see. Yeah. I, I seen when they uh, somebody shot a slug. I think Gilly the Kid. Somebody mm. shot a slug last night. Oh yeah. What? Oh, oh, hey, it was it Gilly the Kid man. or what? Back Who was day. that? Eight ball. Eight ball stopped the whole thing and said something to somebody. Mm. Oh yeah. You know what? I did hear that. You that know what? I, I was that you. Yeah. I, Mm. Yeah, what was that about? Somebody said that Jay Prince had had, had ran him off from somewhere, and, 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 and uh, he, he he said Jay ain't ran him off from nowhere. I remember that dude like in the middle of this whole thing, he just started talking about that. Like he yeah, had to get that yeah, off his he chest. Addressed, uh, he addressed yeah. it. Who did? Who was it that he yeah. was it? Gilly the Kid. Hold on, you know what? Hold on, you know what? I want to say this. I got a phone call. But I'm here. I got a phone call. My partner hit me up and said uh, he was speaking to people addressing things. My partner, I didn't see it yet, but my partner hit me up and was like, hey, what's up with Pimp and Ken? <laughs> what you mean? Uh oh. <laughs> he said Pimp and Ken sound like he was going off on Boss Talk. No, no, no. Oh, me and no, Pimp and Ken no. talk all the time. He was, he was basically, man, it was another guy after he left my uh, uh, interview. 
um, that went and did, said some things that was, if you go watch Beehive, Beehive talked about it, about the boss talk interview. And basically okay, okay, okay. What, what he was saying is another guy, yeah. after we had put our interview out. One of them conspiracy One of these theorists. conspiracy guys took and put people's <laughs> yeah, names in there. That's how rumors get started. You see yeah. that? Yeah, right. yeah, 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 that's again. how rumors get started. Yeah, because Kyle B was like, man, what's going on? I see, I see <laughs> Pippa <laughs> King was going off on Paul South. No. I was like, what? Well, like, well, like, man, what's going on, man? man? You guys gonna, you gonna, me and Pippa King go further than Boss Talk, so you gonna forever see him come on Boss Talk. <laughs> hey, say, but, hey, but I need to talk. Hey, I need to talk to Pippa King, though, my nigga. Get a chance. Pippa King owe me forty dollars, my nigga. Damn. I'm gonna eat that. Oh, yeah, that nigga Pippa King owe me forty dollars, and I'm gonna eat that, fam. Oh, that nigga, that nigga, hey, that nigga, hey, that Pippa DVD. King pulled up. Yeah, the nigga pulled up on me one night, nigga, and hit me with them two DVDs, nigga. I, I pulled a nine out. Hey, I pulled a nine out of that nigga, too, my nigga. I pulled a nine out. I thought I was a four, five band for that nigga all dub. I hit that dude, man. I hit the phone, and then give me two blank ass DVDs. I said, God damn, man. I said, come on, kid. Say, I, I, got, I got a couple dog. of them back here in the back that I'll probably give you when I see you because I don't use them, but I bought them from him anyway. I buy them every time I see him. I probably got about three yeah. of them all. <laughs> yeah, you had niggas in them DVD. You already knew what time it was. I said, man, come on, man. come on, man. I said, I'm thinking I'm gonna get some of that good old vintage pimping. You know, some of that pimp up holes down. Yeah, some of that yeah. some of that good vintage behind no. the scene. I'm like, come on, man. I heard he do exchanges if you bring them back. <laughs> Okay, yeah, that's, I'm my, that's my guy. Right, Next, yeah. he, he, he actually already called me. We already scheduling for him to be back on Boss Talk. He wanna. He always. He's like, man. He when I. He told me. He said when I came on Boss Talk, talk man, it turned me up, nigga. In in in, in Milwaukee. And didn't he tell in everywhere? Yeah. He called me yeah. back about two thirty in the morning after that dude that did that <laughs> and told me that he's like Boss Talk got me turned up yeah. out here. I'm like, damn. Well, really? I don't know. I mean, it's something about Boss Talk, man. I know. You know. I, I did an interview with Boss Talk. I did thirty. Thousand. Oh, you I did an interview with Real Life Street Stars. I only did ten. Really? You know what I mean? Oh. So, yeah, I, yeah. You only did ten. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not knocking them. I'm just saying, boss talk. Oh, they shit. Yeah, I'm not knocking them. My guys. I'm not knocking them. I'm just saying, you know, far as boss talk go, you can see yeah, the shout big out to them boys, man. But, yeah, 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 yeah. They're yeah. my guys. Salute to them. They're my. They're my guy. I grew up with yeah, them. They're yeah. my guys. I definitely. But I was just. I, I, I was just like, man, you know, that Boss Talk interview was hard. You know, they said that Bro, was hard. Man, hey, man, we you gave, you poured your heart out on that thing. And we we, we did some back and forths on there, man, that, mm -hmm. I mean, we we went down through there about Checkahoe, Texas, nigga. Yeah. And I'm, yeah, and I'm, and I'm yeah, telling man. you, I know about <laughs> Checkahoe, Texas. Ain't many niggas going to come up and be like, damn, I know about Checkahoe, nigga. And, and, and really, really know about it, though. Yeah, man. Real you know, like, yeah, like, I'm a real, like, I really mm -hmm. am a dude that when you come on Boss Talk, I don't know, man. I can tell you some things, but I ain't gonna say it. I ain't. Yeah, not I mean, not, not, no, no, no. Just him. by me, not about nobody yeah, else. Don't by do it by to who him. I right. am as a person. Yeah, don't do it. That, that just basically is gonna make this interview go, nigga. Because I'm gonna go there just like you do at night when you give your all to those people, yeah. man. Yeah. It's just something about it, man. I pray for everybody to come on the show, bro. And I think that's what helped me more than anything is putting God first. I'm going to say right. it like that. That's some real talk. Yeah. Right. I'm going to tell you this, though, man. I don't know if you the star of the show, though, my nigga. It might be Mr. Baker. Yeah, I'm talking about, <laughs> man, I don't know it could you, be nigga. Money Moses. I don't know if it's you, nigga. Yeah, man. <laughs> it could be Money Moses, nigga. That's what it could be. It might be that yeah, 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 cause yeah. nigga, nigga checking for money, Moses. But Miss Jamaica, I ain't gonna lie to you. I seen a lot of people cry on this hoe. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, you did. <laughs> but you gave me that perfect setup with money, Moses. Miss Jamaica, y'all got y'all got that breakfast club. Y'all got that breakfast club set up. You know what I'm talking about? Y'all got it going on. You yeah. know what I mean? So that's how I look at y'all at the breakfast club of the South. That new, they know I me. Mean? Yeah, the new cats in the game. Everybody trying to get over there, bro. You know what I mean? So man, you, you know, know you know I rock with y'all boys, Listen, man. man we, we done had a lot of people coming in and co-host. I got Spook right here now, and I got my boy uh, B. Watson here. And, 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 and you know, you, you ain't pulled back up to do no hosting with me. You got to come <laughs> yeah. back through here and holler at me and sit in on. We had uh, we got Larry Hoover Jr. coming out Ooh. next week. I had brought him down and, and, and really put him on with a lot of different people, man. It just was a good look to have him in the city, man. We showed mm -hmm. him mad love. Um, we also, we, we done had a lot of people to come in, man. And I and when these type of people come in, uh, I definitely, I'm going to call you up when people flying in to be on Boss Talk, man, and say, hey, man, come uh, sit hey, down with me. Most definitely. You know I'm trying to come co-host. You already know I'm trying to come sit up there. You know what I mean? So, yeah, get, get my line, bro. You know I'm trying to pull up, that man. That nigga got I'm the energy. Go he got the energy. Yeah, I'm going to go up there and fool with you, bro. I'm going to go up there and fool with you. Let's, 
Hey, let, let's do it. I'm gonna come up there. I'm, I'm in your world. You perfect for yeah. what you do, bro. Like, like you fit, you fit perfect, nigga, in your position. Yeah, not not no, everybody man. can get online and do what you do. Bro. <laughs> hey, you mean, hey, yeah, hey, yeah, hey, you mean say, like I said, hey, like I said, hey, like my, I see, no, you know what my secret is, bro. Like I said, man, growing up, I watched the uh, the David Letterman, I watched the Conan O'Brien, uh, I yeah. watched, you know, the the, the Arsenio Halls. I, you know what I mean? So I try to keep that same energy. I try to just keep that energy going, keep talking, keep moving, keep, you know what I mean? Keep everything going. So, right. yeah, maybe you're going to do that live. Maybe you're going to sit there by yourself. I do a whole hour by myself. Mm, Nobody on the screen yeah. with me, none. Yeah. A whole hour. Yeah. So, yeah. So, <laughs> hey, man, you got to be like, yeah, you got to be Yeah, I be just going. I be going. I be, you, they got to be going. You man, know what I mean? Thank so, you so much, Go for taking my call every time. I always show in Boss Talk 101. Love, bro. You keep going over there, man. Man, I, I, you one of those guys that I really respect, and I thank you for always being there for boss talk, man. What a boss is talk. 100. No, no, salute, man. I'll be back up there soon. Let me know, fam. I'll be up there in a minute. Let for me know, sure, bro. man. Peace and love. Salute. Salute. Nice. Go. Ooh, wee. Yeah, that nigga had a lot to say, man, but he yeah. showed mad love to the, to the Southern, like the, the Southern you know us man you know when i look i did see that 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 one thing eight ball called it out i forgot yeah. about that but he, he did, did uh mm -hmm. yeah he checked something he was trying to check something <laughs> yeah, he, did he, he was did something. he, he was trying to check something in the middle of the he verses made it clear yeah yeah like clear. and and it was like damn like what is coming from you know it wasn't yeah. like he just brought it in there like nigga i got to say this nigga the damn. world got to hear this yeah yeah then it go down like that yeah yeah i heard him and Bun, Bun shows so much love and humility, man. You gotta love him. He was doing that when when pimp, when the pimp was here. Yeah, yeah. He always try to try to hold the people together, and he's yeah. trying. To, he's saying, you know, he's trying to bring everybody together. He don't want that whole disconnect, and I get it, man. But man, we want and need that respect for what the South has brought to the table. I will continue to chant that the whole time because mm -hmm. we got some great artists down here too, and we want to give them a great look, you know. Right. And thank you, man. Thank you, uh, B. Watts, and thank you, Spook, for coming on Ball Stock. This is your first time on the show. Yeah, it is. <laughs> I mean, welcome. How'd you like it? It was a surprise. It was a surprise? It was a surprise. <laughs> Spook got bought a car. Y'all just don't know. Spook got bought a car. Spook, yeah, Spook a whole damn celebrity in here, but y'all don't know it yet, but y'all gonna know it, man. Yo, what's up? Yo, man? what's going on? Bobo Luciani hey, in the building. Bobo, what's going Bobo. on, baby? Bobo. What's good? What's going on, man? Y'all got me on that road, hey, hey, listen, man. I got my boy Brandon, man. That boy B. Watts and that boy Spook, man. He in the building, what's man. What's and we, up? What's we, good? We, we've been talking about the verses from last night, man. We know you down there in Atlanta. You gonna give us the insight on what went down because, man, it was hot. It was definitely dope. Uh, I, I missed Pimp a lot last night, bro. Uh, I ain't gonna lie to you, but it was dope. You can't say it was hype because the mood was like kind of sad. Well, let, let, let me hear what Bobo, he was, like, was in there. Was he was in there, nigga. Man. I'm gonna tell you the I'm gonna tell you the deal was. Okay. Everybody was so excited and wanted to film when they filmed it. When they filmed, you know, everybody had their cameras out. Couldn't nobody applaud. Couldn't nobody, everybody was so Quark on, let me record record this history. Mm. That's why they said, man, put your phones up. You can always go back to YouTube and watch it later. But nigga was like, fuck that. We want to get this. <laughs> That's what it was. Right, That's right. why the crowd wasn't into it. Going live, nigga. That's what, yeah, that was right up front. I could have been backstage with everybody. I'm like, nah, I want to I wanna feel this shit. Yeah, yeah. You know, and, and, and my boy, he'll tell you, you know, I'm getting ready to start this podcast, so I feel my... You know, that's part of the media. So I feel like I got to be part of the media now right. and start recording stuff. Yeah. So I was out there in the crowd with the regular folks. I hadn't done that in 30 years. Been out, been out <laughs> in the crowd, in a concert. Come on, man. I, wanna, I, I just want to give me, give me the highlight moment of the night for you. Yeah. Now, for me, I'm going to tell you, it, it was not the music. The highlight moment was when Christian MC Dawn and jumped on that stage. Mm. Dope, dope. That was so dope. I was just telling my boy, I'm riding through my boy uh, Zay ATL. Shout out to my man Zay ATL, right out of the west side of Allen Temple. You know what I'm saying? Okay, I'm okay. riding around with him right now. Uh, shout he out. got me taking me to all. Shout out. He got me. I mean, he just took me to uh, 
going home, we're going home with Shorty, we're Shorty Lope, Leo, and uh, T.I. T.I. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Big thing Poppins. You know, I, I see him right there, man, and uh, he took me to the Blue Flame. I, I took yeah. I'm, I just want to, I said, man, take me all over. I'm a ghetto nigga. Take me to the hood. You right, man. I want to see the hood. Right. Yeah, I, I, think, and, I, I think that's but, dope, man. But, but back to that, man, yeah, they, um, the highlight of that was, was when she jumped on stage and I was just telling him, I really didn't even get, get to see the last two songs because as soon as she jumped off the stage, I went searching for her. Mm. And yeah. I couldn't, I couldn't find it. And man, I wanted to, I hadn't seen her since the funeral. Yeah. So, and I just really wanted to, you know, exchange information with her and let her know that I'm in her corner and anything she needs, I want her to be able to reach out to me because, you know, I'm big on women. So you, you, didn't, you, didn't, get, want, you didn't get to catch her? I didn't get to catch her. And then, and then just today, when, and I did B.I. Uh, shout out to B.I. Yeah, B. I. shout out to B.I. Mm -hmm. you know, I had to bring a boss out. He shot a child. Already, you know already. Uh, yeah, that's I'm, number low. I'm going to tell you right now, man. I'm going to tell you right now. If y'all don't, don't know what's going on with the boss talk shit, boss talk has got something real special going on. And for these boys down here in Atlanta to be, you know, on board with what's going on with the boss talk, that's major. Yeah, that's yeah, major. yeah. I don't know. Right. That's real. You know, you know right. my man, he is real humble about it. He ain't going to toot his own horn, but I'm going to toot his own horn for him. I'm going to give him his flowers. <laughs> He's something you can listen in a year, man. Man, well, it's about yeah, look, a little yeah. more than a year now. A yeah. little more than a year now. Yeah. And people ask me, am I hired on Bob Stout now? <laughs> I'm <laughs> you, trying you, to you, be you, you more than four times on Bob I was like, man, I'm a special host. I'm a guest host. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's my, that's my family. Yeah. I'm a what they call a special guest host. Man, you can and, come and, and anytime. Yes, sir. You can come yeah. anytime. Hey. And, you and, know, and I, you... I didn't mean to get off. I didn't mean to get off subject like that, but I got to talk about E, man. That that boss yeah. talk and and E high. It was really, really in LA. We got something special going on at Dallas with this media, and man. everybody needs to get on board. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. You guys coming out showing some love, man. But that versus, man. And verses was something to be seen. And 2022 has been a special year for Bun B and myself. I mean, the rodeo, uh, the verses. Bun got the trio burgers going on. I was able to come out of my shell and meet with my man, ECEO, yeah. shooting with the boss house. Uh, he's helping me with my podcast, the Super Type podcast. Yes, sir. It's, it's, you know, it's just. It's, it's, it's about to be special in 2022. And then, you know, and we and we talk about working. Guess what Bun is right now? Well, yeah. I mean, before I woke up this morning, I get up this morning, man, at about 9.30. I check my phone, Bun said, nigga, I would just touch down in Toronto, Canada. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy, he on the boat. That's working, working, man. That's working, man. Oh, boy, working. That's working, man. Yeah, it is. That's working, man. Yeah, and and like I said, man, this it was good to see. Uh, I want to, I want to just really, I'm a, I'm a real MJG eight ball fan as well because MJG, of the time, bro. bro. MJG, that nigga start don't make me nigga <laughs> say nigga boy. boy I come up out the seat. I say boy, that nigga that fresh boy. <laughs> Let me tell you something about MJG, man. Cause I'm telling you, I'm from Rowing. I got a new respect for him, JG, man. Yeah. I was an eight ball fan. Me too. Uh, he shut that down last that night. <laughs> that boy is the ultimate professional. Man, listen, yeah, Low DZ yeah. had told me that because I was sleeping on MJG, yeah, man. man. I was like, MJG, man, he all right. You know what I'm I know I've been listening to him the whole time, but I never thought no. about him as being the one with the, because they wanted, you know, I thought, I'm like, dang, I'd love to see MJG and Pimp C if they'd have done an album together. Like, mm. I'm tripping, like, well, see, last well, see, night. Let me tell you, like I told you before, I put, I put Pimp and A-Ball in the same category. They from the streets. Yeah, they you know they represent the streets and Bond and MJG are in the same category with the lyrics. Yeah, yeah. But last night, my nigga, 
the way that boy was rapping mm. and sounded just like the rapper. Yeah, man. And I man. man, we over 50, bro. Uh, man. We over 50 years old. That boy was kicking and popping and doing his things <laughs> like he playing the piano. I said, man, this nigga doing this shit, my nigga. <laughs> it's yeah. in the door in July. Mm-hmm. It sounded like the record. It sound just like the record. Man, I'm sorry. Man, man I'm glad I, you. I'm, but I'm glad. I, I, that, but listen. I'm glad that you made that trip. I'm glad you know me and you talked before you went. And I'm like, man, you gotta be there, man. You gotta be there for the pimp. Because because you you one of those guys, man, the energy of you being in the room was something for me as a fan. So man, just man, kudos to you, man. Kudos to Bun, man, kudos to MJG eight ball for Triller. You know, all of the different people, man, Greg Street and I heard my boy Al D. They play Al D three hundred on that whole last night. Yeah. Al, yeah, they play Played Al D last night, <laughs> nigga. Hey man, they playing Southern shit. Yeah, I went to uh, right off the hip. We went to uh, Two Chain spot. Two Chain got a a little club type restaurant type thing. We went there, mm. nigga. They was getting fat pimp. I was like, they hey, getting fat pimp. Shout out, shout mm. out to my family. Shout out pimp? to my family, fat pimp, man. Shout out to fat oh, pimp, man. man. That is family it's right there. Going man. down in the south, man. I love that the south. You know, hey, you know, I was already. You know, I've been uh, one. I, I was trying to. You know, I'll be all out of order. I was trying to put the verses in Texas, nigga, or in Memphis, nigga. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm crazy. I'll be thinking like, man, <laughs> you know how I'll be acting. But I know Atlanta is doing oh, yeah. crazy stuff. I know they winning. I know they got Tyler Perry Studios, man. Yeah. But we all yeah. down here, yeah. nigga. We yeah. We brothers all down yeah. here in the South, man. Hey, let me tell you something. I went in that whole <laughs> military guy, bro. I'm going to really go to war. You just need to take for life. <laughs> <laughs> but, but once I, you know, I'm, really, you know, I'm so I'm so and alone. I'm like, this nigga, you should take for life. Yeah. But when brothers say, nigga, oh. ain't got on stage to say, you're for the South. This ain't no competition. Yeah. I kind of, I kind of let my I kind of let my guard down. Okay. Oh, okay. Bobo's in that old puffed up, up nigga. Bro, I miss George. I miss George. That boy, he bought that big team ring. Them boys came yeah. weak. Now they did yeah. slack on. They did slack on. So I'm gonna tell you right now, if you want the competition, you just can't win. You just can't win because even Bud did not slack. That nigga fuck. That nigga. Hey, Bob and MJG came with some songs I didn't recognize a couple yeah, times. Yeah. <laughs> but, but, and for them not to play Don't Flex, they didn't play Don't Flex, my nigga. Ooh, that hoe go hard, nigga. So hold on, hold on. They, they didn't play Don't Flex. Let me, yeah. let me ask you this. Would it been better yeah. if they would have did a holographic of Pimp C? I think I like the way Bud did it. Okay. You see, if y'all notice how Bud constructed it, you know how he was doing the one verses, mm-hmm. one verse, the first verse of the song, and going to the next, but it was always the song that had pimp rapping first. Yeah, did okay. y'all notice that? Yeah, yeah. Pimp still was in the house, bro. Yeah, pimp believe me, I told y'all yeah. already. I, I got a little depressed because I miss I mean, pimp, man. I mean, yeah, I, I, I mean, would have loved to see that milk coat and them glasses, mint coat yeah. and glasses. And, but, you know, but, you know, but think about this, though. Think about this. But I'm young too. They put this together. They put this. They put this together in four years. I mean, four days. Exactly. I said, I, said, one, uh, two, I said three, three days. You say five. One more week. If we'd have had one more week, I think Jesus would have been there. Mm-hmm. I think Andre T. Thousand would have been there. Yeah, Jeezy G- 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 was hurt. T. I would have been there. Yeah, Jeezy yeah, G- 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 in Dallas right now. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's Memorial Day weekend. They picked a holiday weekend mm-hmm. to pull a sneaker car. You can't do no shit like that. And it's been mm-hmm. four days, but it, it still went off. Uh, it still went off. I don't know. Well, no. No, nah, it, it went it went it went down, man. You got plies in the city right now. Yeah. You got G's in the city right now. And you got that boy. Guess who else you got in the city? Who? Uh who the, the, the 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 nigga that used to be on the little the prince. What's his name? Scrappy, uh, little scrappy. Little scrap. okay. Yeah, little these scrap. niggas in yeah. the they, these scrap. niggas in the city yeah. right now. I will get a promotion in Dallas, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 what project we in, man? 
Nigga, I'm in y'all a triple right now. Already, right? nigga. Uh, already. Uh, already, nigga. Get yeah, it how you yeah, live, yeah. nigga. You supposed to be in the... Yeah, that way, you, here, you ain't doing nothing but acting like me when you go to other people's city, man, going in the hood, nigga. Man. Yeah. You yeah, ain't went yeah, to the pink trap. He ain't went to the what? He ain't, went, he ain't went to the pink trap yet. What's that? Like, what you want? What, 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 what's the pink trap? The pink trap with two uh, two oh, chains museum. Oh, oh the museum. Yeah, oh, the yeah. 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 Okay, okay, okay. Got clothes, yeah. nigga. Hey, he's oh, trying to see the real deal. Holy shit! Oh field. man, he's trying to see the real deal. I think they want to take me there. My niggas, they want to take me there. But I said, well, he want to go to the real. Yeah, he want to see the real. You want to go? You want to go see snow in the blood? Hey, did you go see? Yeah, go check that boy out. Let me tell you why I go to the crowd museum. Yeah. Because we leave that shit. Hey, that is, nigga. I don't want to play uh, with nobody. Uh, I, 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 real talk. You're like, I think I, it, it paperwork showing. I don't even need to be around nothing like that. Yeah, we're doing that shit, man. Yeah, man. I don't need to go back to that lifestyle. I seen it all. We did it all. <laughs> That's real, man. Microwave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, nigga. Yeah, nigga. Yeah, nigga. Yeah, yeah, nigga. Yeah, yeah, nigga. Yeah, let a nigga get the shake just so he can watch the cars. Nigga, stop playing, nigga. Come on, real, man. Real stop. talk. Man, the cookie started in the 80s, man. Stop it. <laughs> Them squares, yeah, nigga. Man, I, I, I know you done went to Gladys Knight restaurant down there. Oh. Gladys Knight restaurant? Yeah. Gladys Knight yeah. restaurant. Yeah. The, I went to it. Went to I'm going to tell you where my boy Zay took me. I'm going to tell you where my boy Zay took me. Okay. He took me to a, um, he took me to a famous spot. Where was that spot at Zay? What part of the town? No, it was in, but no, no, the, the restaurant. What part of town was it in? What was What was it? Zay? Yeah, what, what, what part of town? What, uh, what town? South side. So we was on the south side of the land. He said we could spun dilly. Let me tell y'all something. I'm gonna tell you why I heard of spun dilly. My man Noriega, because I'm true hip hop. Noriega used to have a podcast about food. And Big Boy took Noriega to Spun Dillies about five years ago. Okay. So right then and there I called my boy thing in Atlanta. I said, Look, that food good. He said, Man, it's the shit. G Z in there, T I B there. Everybody be in there. <laughs> I said, I want to go. In, in other words, it's our Papa Dose. Okay, okay, yeah. okay. Uh, okay. On Divot is like Papa Dose to Houston or Dallas. Oh, okay. Even really? though they got Papa Dose here now. Mm, yeah. But man, let me tell you, the food, the food was excellent. The the the, okay. the, 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 the service was excellent. Shout out to Spun Divot. Uh, Boss Out 101 got you back. You know, let me tell you. Oh, really? It was a beautiful situation. You yeah, know, yeah, hey. Spun Divot. Spun Divot right there. Mm. And let me tell you something. I don't know if you drink or not. See, I'm an old school drinker. And so is, so is they. I don't drink. Yeah, but man. back in the day when I did drink, I'm from Oak Cliff. Yeah. Singing Hills to be exact. And yeah. anybody yeah. know anything about Singing Hills, on Singing Hills Boulevard, there, there, used, there used to be a club that's about to reopen. What do you it's, know about the lights in the room? club. What no, 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 no. Oh, boy, stop. What stop it, it. Lazy Rumble. What is it called? That nigga say Lazy Rumble. Yeah. My nigga. Okay, let me tell you something. Okay, okay, okay. Check this out. Right there by Lazy Rumble. What club? What, what club is right there? What club is right there? I'm too young to know. It was. It, it definitely wasn't. The, hey, the Cliff Club got them, them oh, Long Island teams. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! There you go. That's the what it was. Club, right the Cliff Club, Club. Okay. That's what it it's coming the back. Club, the, the Cliff Club. Your Cliff. My my homeboy. Shout out to my man. He just he just bought the Cliff Club. Him and a couple of guys. They about to reopen the Cliff okay. Club. But the Cliff Club is famous. For stupid strong drink. That's right. <laughs> I'm stupid, I'm a, I'm stupid, stupid strong drink. Nigga, I'm a, and I'm not no drinker. E. Every time, every time I come to ball starts he offer me a drink and I turn it down. <laughs> but I'm a margarita drink. I drink margaritas. Margaritas, nigga, 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 nigga they don't bring margaritas out there. Like, what the fuck are they doing? <laughs> so it's, it's well worth it for y'all to come to Spun Dippy. I mean, I'm gonna come nigga, take it out. Spun you can mean that's rich nigga food. Oh, oh, they got the little white plates, nigga. Yeah, so I know he. That's right up your alley, man. You better know I'm gonna pull up, nigga. Say, as soon as I it's get real, down I'm there. Believe, 
Man, yeah, come on, man. So you and me, my wife. Yeah, we got, we got to make a trip. You me, Jamaica, Jazzy K, we got to come back. I couldn't do it like I wanted to. They, my man, AP, they, they just got me going how I want to go. Say, nigga. Let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. As soon as I got off the plane, really, I get in my rental car. I'm trying to look up fucking navigation. The police, boo, roll me. Oh, damn. Uh, so, nigga, I've been on edge ever since I pulled. <laughs> <laughs> they say, hold on, that's Bobo. The street, the street, the street's so narrow. And you know what? I'm rolling with that stanky, stanky, stanky. And I'm like, man, I can't. Yeah. I can't just get rolled down in the, in, in, in mm-hmm. I keep on thinking about uh, 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 outcast talking about the red dog police. I'm like, man, I don't want to get involved with him. <laughs> uh, mm. Oh, man. Hey, Bobo, I'm going to get your night back, nigga. We can go all night. I'll call you. Hey, I'm going to call you tomorrow. You're going to be when you, whenever. Let, I'll call you tomorrow. Hey, man, I'll be home, man. i touch down at 3 o'clock. Okay, okay. I'll be in Texas at 2 o'clock. I got y'all it. pray for my flight, man. Come on, man. We all oh, got you, man. That, man. Come on, man. Yeah. Stop playing. We love you, Bobo. Got you. Love y'all too, man. Yes, Shout sir. out to my niggas, man. Y'all, y'all keep rapping, man. For whatever sure. y'all do, y'all keep rapping, y'all keep doing y'all thing, represent from where y'all from, and whatever you say, listen to him, man. That, that, man, y'all like God, nigga. Nigga. <laughs> that nigga say, that nigga say, I'm like God, nigga. I love y'all when y'all be doing bad stuff, <laughs> good stuff, unconditional love, agape love, nigga. That's what he's saying. Hey, man. Hey. Man, listen to it. That nigga said, "Cop ain't love." I hear you, my nigga. You know what? Oh shit! I heard him. Hey, you got you one, baby. You got you one. Hey, man. Y'all stay safe, man. I'm gonna get some more drinking and some more smoking in me. Y'all stay up already, I'm man. I'm on one. Say, man. Have fun yeah. for me. Yes, sir. Later. Man, that boy Bobo, man. That's what I'm talking Shout about. Yeah. Boss Talk 101, man. Smooth, yeah. man. You see, did you get you some? Uh, you was like you were sitting there when you talked to Bobo. Bobo was there last night. He down mm. in Atlanta for that versus. Yeah, he was. Yeah, yeah. he made me think. He was. I saw him. One. He stood out. I saw him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He definitely. Shout out the, the camera. The cameraman found him and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Check it, man. It was. It's been another great segment of Boss Talk 101, man. The hardest, livest show in the South, man. Ooh. Check it, man.